up guys back again with another video i've been off for a while um just had to take a break for a while just to recollect myself and everything uh but uh i am reviewing power rangers episode five which is winning winning attitude i believe and uh it is a is the centric episode her first um, episode around her and the premise is that she wants to win this win this race and she's trained by her Special Olympics cousin uh, Lily but when um, Lily abandons her training to help out a friend then their relationship is kind of put to the test but um Overall, my thoughts, uh, okay, my thoughts about this episode, um, Izzy is definitely the most, the most athletic out of all the Rangers. She's confident, strong, brave, uh, courageous, and, uh, so far, she's probably one of my favorite characters out of the group of Rangers. Um... And she comes, so she becomes, um, because of her competitive, competitiveness, she becomes so obsessed with winning because she wants to make her dad proud. And there, it's basically, um, she doesn't want to disappoint her dad and let her dad down. And when she misses it, when her cousin Lily misses and a the practice thing to help her to help her practice for the the race or whatever she takes it out on her and she doesn't even give her an opportunity to tell her why she was late but she tells Lil lily tells izzy there's more to life than just winning and um when they're on the race you know when the race begins uh one of the competitors competitors uh oh uh, oh uh go back go back a little bit i learned something out when izzy finds out that the reason that lily didn't train her and skipped out on the training was because she had to help her friend who has a broken leg um then that's when she realizes that that hey it's not always about me and i shouldn't care for other people's feelings and stop being so what's the word selfish um but when the ra the race begins of course and then one of the competitors goes down with ankle injury and Izzy helps her out and during the race she stumbles upon mucus i believe that's their name mucus she runs into them and battles them and she um gets her Zord, um, which is pretty cool, um, and I like the slow build to getting the Zords in this season, it's not all, uh, like the other Power Ranger seasons, not all of the, uh, other Ranger, not all, not all of the Rangers have the Zords right away, and I like their like how they're slowly building it up, kind of like how they did in Dino Charge. I really like that. Instead of all of the Rangers having all the Zords right away and introducing all the Rangers all at once, I like how this season, the the pacing for this season is working really well. I love it. Um, but Izzy, after they beat the monster, Izzy finishes the race. Um, and even though she didn't win, her cousin Lily gives her a gives her her medal that she won, and you know they have a good moment. And when her dad finds out the reason that she, um, you know, when she finds out, when he finds out the reason he about uh, helping the competitor out that hurt her ankle, then you know it's all well and good, and he forgives her, they have a funny moment, haha, -ha. that's the end, um, I, 
really enjoyed this episode. This is probably um, probably one of my favorite episodes so far because of the importance of the, ep of the episode. This is the first Power Ranger episode involving someone with special needs. And I really love that they were pretty focused on that. And I really, I mean, they should have done this a long time ago, to be honest with you. Um, but I'm glad we're getting it now. And I really did, I really do hope we see more of this in the future. Or someone, or a LGBTQ character in the Power of the Universe or something like that. This was a really well written episode. These are my ups and downs for their episodes. Um, let me know what you guys thought. Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.